In this video, I want to show you how to um, add an opening balance for leave for employees. Uh, so uh, we would go start by going to payroll and you want to go to the employees tab. Now you may have seen this option when you were adding in employees um, into the system. So for example, if you're wanting um, to apply an opening balance to an employee, this would probably come from the fact that you've been using a different accounting software and you're starting payroll with zero, um, starting pay payroll fresh with zero. So you add, you'll be adding in these employees, but they're going to have no annual leave, only the annual leave and sick leave that they accrue per week in zero. Uh, so we want to pass on to them what they they um, have earned and we want them to be able to see that in the pay slip. So, um, yeah, if you have already added in the employees, you'll see something like this and you'll click on their name. Okay, so you want to go over to the leave tab. Now, as this is a demo company, we can see that um, they've already got annual leave and personal carers leave. So if you haven't assigned a leave type, this will be blank and you would want to click on the assign leave type and add in the type of leave there, the calculation method. We would normally go based on ordinary earnings, so that would change as per how many hours they've done in that, that pay week. That is the hours accrued, you know, it's a standard amount for a full-time employee. Um, and the, so here, this is what I really want to talk about, is the opening balance. So they might have had, you know, 80 hours from previous accounting software. And you would pop, pop that in there and hit save. Let's go back, close. So that, we hadn't selected a leave type, which is why we got the error. All right, so they've already got leave types, so we're actually just going to go in and edit um, the current leave that they've got. So you just click on the number. Okay, now that's already filled out. He already had an opening balance of 150, but, um, Upon checking, it was only 80 that he had, 80 hours. So we hit save, and that would adjust his annual leave accordingly. We can do the same for personal carer's leave. And in fact, he had 80 hours of personal carer's leave, which is your sick leave. All right, so that is how you add in an opening balance. If you're um, popping in your employees there that have been transferred over from old accounting software.